So if I know this is a right triangle and I know the hypotenuse is five newtons, that's why I chose five newtons, then I automatically know from geometry the other two sides of the triangle. So what does that mean intuitively? What it means is that some of this force is being horizontally directed. How much of this force? Four newtons of it. In fact, if I wanted to, I could kind of draw this triangle having a little arrowhead right here because I'm pushing to the right with four newtons and a little arrowhead straight up pushing up with the amount of three newtons. You see, the five newton force is acting at some angle. And so I need to go ahead and write that angle in here. So there's some angle. I'm not going to tell you what this angle is right now, but it's definitely not zero. It's some angle. And when I angle it exactly at the correct angle, I get a three, four, five triangle. The five newton force is then broken up into what we call components. The horizontal part of the force is four newtons, and the vertical part of the force is three newtons. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.